So once we open up the game software, this is going to look like this. Here you can see three different windows, right? Before we dive in to create the actual t-shirt design, it is probably the good idea to go over the interface little bit and be familiar with it. On the very left side, here we have our toolbox. Bunch of different tools are available like zoom tool, move tool, color picker and so on. And under this, here we have a tab which is called tools option. If you click any of these tools over here, then you can see tool options are changed, right? That because this tools options tab is associated with all of these particular tools. Alright? On the very left side, here we have our layers and brushes panel. This is our layer panel and here you can see the available brushes. Alright? And this middle window is called workspace. If you want to increase this workspace size, then simply click on this corner and drag it down. Alright, so this is basically our artboard or you may say workspace. To create a new file in this workspace, simply go to File, New, and in this Create a New Image window, here you can see a few different options. You can change width height and in advanced option, you can also change the PPI value, color space, fill with that means background color and also you can add additional comment. And in this drop down menu, here you can see bunch of different templates are available. Choose any of your preferred template. But for our t-shirt design, we need higher resolution image size, right? And for this, I just simply choose width 4500 pixels and set height 5400 pixels. I set these values in pixels. You can also use this in inch, but I always prefer to use pixels. This image resolution is 72 ppi. If you want to change this value, then simply put your preferred resolution. This time I choose 300 by 300, alright? And color space, I choose RGB color. And fill with color, I choose simply white. And to create a new image file, I just simply hit on OK. Alright, so our artboard is just created. Now, if you want to customize any of these game software settings, then simply go to File and select Preferences. You can easily change Environment, Interface, Theme, Toolbox, Default Image Options, etc. I recommend you to come here and play around with these different options. So this is basically the basic overview of game software interface. From our next lecture, we will start designing our t-shirt using GIMP. Thank you so much for watching.